A new safe haven baby box is now operational in Zionsville at Fire Station 92 on US 421. This marks the 100th safe haven baby box. Since the first box was installed in Indiana at the Woodburn Fire Department in 2016, the people behind safe haven baby boxes have helped parents safely and anonymously surrender at least 130 infants. A family firm from southern Indiana shows how it's not only the person surrendering an infant who is impacted, they gained a family member thanks to this program. She was surrendered um, in 2019 in northern Indiana, and about that time uh, there were only a few, uh, a few boxes at that time. So um, we're from southern Indiana, and we didn't know about the Safe Haven Baby Box organization at that time. So it's just amazing that in three years how much this organization has accomplished. Keegan and Tessa Higgs adopted their daughter Nola about two years ago. Nola's birth, birth mother had called the Safe Haven Baby Box hotline to surrender her child. These boxes are equipped with silent alarms that notify officials immediately that a baby has been surrendered. To see where all of Indiana's Safe Haven Baby Boxes are located, we have a map in this story on our website, WRTV.com and on the WRTV app.